This is the Chinese cooking channel called Chinese Cooking Channel. Today I'm going to show you how to recondition a wok. So if you have a day of hard cooking where the surface is really rough or you burn some food into the wok, I'm going to show you how to recondition the wok so it's better than brand new. I wonder if you can see the fried rice that was burned into the wok. That was because I, my battery ran out and I didn't shut off the wok I was frying rice. So you get this uh, crusty rice on the bottom. So what I'm going to do now is uh, show you how to recondition or reseason a wok. After you fry some rice, I'm going to put some more oil in there. So I've got the heat on uh, medium high right now. So what I'm going to do now is just put the, some salt in there. So just watch out for the rice, it's actually flying off the wok here. So you know the oil heats it up and it starts to fly off the, the wok. So I put about uh, maybe say six teaspoons of salt in there. So, so I use this uh, napkin. Just to scrape at it. So you have the salt. It's actually it's like a scrubber. So you just scrub the uh, scrub the fried rice that's stuck on the bottom. Also do the side. So you see it's already done. So I shut the heat off, but I'm still doing a last last uh, scrub here. So it's nice. Uh, Nice surface again. So I'm just gonna scrape that into the into the box here. I have this uh, bamboo brush. It's the home version. It's not that big. It's only about uh, maybe eight inches long. The big the big ones are a lot bigger. Uh, they're maybe uh, 16 inches or whatever. So those are the commercial ones. This is a small one. It's good for home. Uh, cleaning for the wok. So just check in the description below my video. So you you can buy this uh, This uh, bamboo wok brush in my Chinese cooking accessory guide That's in the description Below this video. So usually I cook uh, the surface is pretty clean. I just use this brush and so You see it's pretty clean. So I just turned the uh, wok to a medium heat so I'm just going to wipe this down and turn the heat on. So as you can see there's a bit of scarring there where the uh, rice got stuck to the wok so you still see it. But that's okay because later on that uh, thick surface is going to help build the patina finish. So now we're just going to heat the uh, wok up a little bit and then uh, just do it for a few minutes. 5-10 minutes. I uh, wiped it dry already. We're just going to put a little bit of uh, cooking oil there. So put about a tablespoon in there and so it's not really hot. You can turn the heat off if you like now. So I'm just going to wipe this uh, wok down with with a paper napkin. Uh, this uh, reseasons the uh, wok. So you, every day when you use your carbon steel wok you should uh, clean it with a bamboo brush. You don't need soap uh, most of the time. Uh, mild detergent if you need it. And then uh, just uh, Wipe it off with a, uh, a few drops of oil, usually less than what I put in today. Just a few drops and uh, use a napkin so this way you get a nice uh, surface. Uh, it's not going to rust if you don't use it for a few days. Use a wok for a few days. So, so there you have it. This is how to uh, recondition and reseason a used wok for better days to come for Chinese cooking. Thanks for checking out my video. Please like and subscribe. Any comments are always welcome. Take care and stay safe.